All right, now we're working better? Okay. I'm going to buy some potatoes, I think. Um, right, it's the 11th, so I can buy a lot of potatoes. Not a lot, but you know, 25 or so. That'll just keep me busy for a bit. Okay. And it's raining, so that's a that's a really good day to plant. I am usually a Switch player, and I just started playing on the computer, so I have a new farm here. Um, but I do have a farm where I'm like a year or two in on my Switch, so uh, I've started a new kind of romance some new people and do some mods, hopefully, because I can. Um, we should hoe that a little bit. And this little bit. There we go. All right. So how are you doing today? Are you having a good day? On this Wednesday? Let's see. I just started playing this game recently. I just figured out how to do mods. We sat down and I put in, um, so my house, I changed my house. Um, I'm good, I'm good. I worked a little bit, got some new hiking boots, so we're gonna start to do some hiking in a, a little place behind our house, so I'm excited for that. And then I figured out how to do mods. That took me <laughs> a while. Um, I did, I don't have a horse yet or any animals, but when I do, I have a, I got the mod for a prismatic horse, which I'm super excited about. So it's like got a rainbow mane, which is really cool. And some different looking animals, like the animals are more cute kind of kawaii looking. Um, what else did I mod out? I've been playing with like color recoloring ones, but I haven't figured out exactly one that I like on that. I also need to start playing The Sims on here too. Like I, I think I finally got a good computer is what it is. But I'm a big Sims person. I've been Sims forever. Uh, I really like Sims. And I've been playing... I just finished Time at Porsche. Have you ever played that one? It's kind of like Stardew Valley-ish. Uh, with a little more... You have more projects, I guess. You still have to kind of save the town. And that one was really fun. Yeah, and then I finally beat it, and now I'm like, I mean, I didn't beat it. I guess it's an open world, but I beat it enough where there's nothing else to do, really. I beat, like, the very end of it. The new Sims, or is there a new Sims that came out? Am I not up on the times, maybe? Oh, inventory. Oh, time at Porsche. Um, I don't know. If I, I have the one for the Switch, but I don't know if it was the... I think they're... Yeah, I don't have the newest one yet. I kind of mourned the loss of that one. That one was really fun. And I had just gotten, like, married and everything, and I could still go back, but made me a little sad when I kind of finished all of the tasks. I should have gone a little bit slower, I think. And then I got, ooh, time at Sandrock. Okay, I'm gonna look that up. I'm gonna, I'm gonna definitely, because I really did like time at Porsche. You're just like in a neighboring city, right? 
it's something like nearby or something. And then I got, um, oh gosh, Rune Factory. But I've not gotten very far in that one. Um, I don't know. I'm just not, I'm not vibing with it. You can farm in that, but I don't know. I've played a little bit. I mean, I've probably put in like 10 hours in it or something, but I'm just not really too excited about it. 2022? Oh, well, I can wait. I can do it on the computer then. It's probably better anyways to see it on the big screen. I'll have to start doing some of those and streaming that maybe. That'd be cool. Because I just finished Time at Porsche probably like two or three weeks ago. And couldn't figure out what else to play. <laughs> so I came back to Stardew Valley for a bit. It is more fun when it's modded, though. I'm trying not to do... I think I got the map mod, too, on here. So there's the... Like, the one where you can see where everybody is. I got that one, too, which is kind of cool. That's helpful, I think. But I'm trying not to go too crazy. Like, I haven't found one. I was looking for a fishing one to make it easier to fish. But I couldn't figure out which one to get. Because there was, like, a lot of options. But some of them said that they don't work with the update. And so I need to do more research on that one. Because I really suck at fishing. And I know there's ones out there that, like, make it easier. And you don't have to do the little mini game or whatever. Because fishing is the bane of my existence. 120 mods. Oh my gosh. I need to step up my game clearly. I think I have like 12. <laughs> I need to get to work for sure. So what's your favorite one? Like what's the one you would recommend? Or top, I don't know, top five. Because I do, need something. Don't ever want to look at my sins. <laughs> That's funny. That's funny. Yeah, there's too many options on here for sure. What am I doing here? Oh, well, it's raining. I don't really have anything to do here, but I'm just going to clear out my farm. But I want the one... I saw one that, like, if you marry the person, you don't get their room. Which is good. Because I always hate when they ruin my aesthetic with their, their room. And then I need a fishing one because I need to figure out how to cheat at fishing properly. <laughs> I finally hunkered down and, like, fished a little bit on my... Uh, other game to try to at least get to like a level three but I just I don't know my husband's really good at the fishing part I can't do it <laughs> which makes the community center really hard it's really hard like animal crossing the fishing is easy but no it sucks on here so do you have a mod that it just skips the... Do you just not do the fishing part of the little fishing game? Instant cat. Yes. Okay, I need that one. I for sure need that one. Oh, I can't pick that up. I'll come back for you, maybe. I'll probably forget where you are. Yeah, I need the instant catch mod for sure. Because that probably makes getting the community center easier as well, huh? Alright. Oh, I was supposed to go see that dadgum wizard. 
I think it's in the CJB cheats menu mod on Nexus. Sweet. I will make a note of that. A handy dandy notebook. Okay. CJB. Cool. I'll check it out. All right. I guess I will go to sleep and meet the wizard tomorrow. Yes, I'll go to sleep. Well, it's not a bad day. All right. No. All right, I need to make a scarecrow too. We'll be holding the egg festival. All right, so I'm gonna beat out a little kid. So scarecrow, we needed. I think those things, right? Um, let's see. No. Coal and wood. Do I not have fifty wood yet? No, I have that. I need coal. I had one right down here somewhere that I said I would never find again. <laughs> And now I never will. Okay, hold on. Where is that coal at? Was it here? Drats. Oh no. I lost my coal because I knew I was going to. Is it in the other quadrant, maybe? Spent all my time trying to find that one piece of coal. It's not gonna happen. Probably just disappeared, huh? Well, okay. Alright, I'm gonna go meet the wizard. Which is down here somewhere, right? I don't remember the trees growing so fast in the last version. Is it my imagination or... I feel like those seeds are popping up everywhere. Wild horseradish. Alright. He's somewhere over here, right? Did I go too far? I did. Don't mind me, I never know where I'm going. And I know there's a map, but <laughs> that's okay. Huzzah, we found him. All right. So I watch a lot of TikToks where they talk about like all the conspiracy theories of of the who's who world of Stardew Valley and how the they say that the wizard is Abigail's dad and that because I don't know that so I guess there was some cheating involved or something. Because she has purple hair, is what they're saying. And I don't know what else. Maybe there's more to the story later. I have found her before hanging out outside the wizard's house in the middle of the night just staring at a tree. But that is just Abigail in general. So she eats rocks and stares at things. Oh, yeah. Well, there's, there's lots of... I follow quite a few people that will post their stories and stuff. Yeah, she's she's, she's interesting. <laughs> but she's an easy one if you want to woo her, right? Because you just give her amethyst every day. 
Have you seen the app for Stardew Valley? Do you have the app? It's the most amazing. Let me see. Let me pull it up. Yes, I found the golden scroll. Let me pull it up. Now he's gonna go fly away. Oh yeah, really? He likes quartz. Okay, so uh, hold on. You can see it, but this is my favorite app on the phone. You just click on the person, and it tells you everything that they like, all in one place. And it has saved me so much time because I'll just go to the bar on Friday night, and I know it, at least most of the people are there. Right, because the town's a lot of, of alcoholics. And I'll just go in there and just pick one thing off of the list for everybody. And that really helps get friends really fast. One with the forest. Oh, I'm about to get high. Okay, let's go. <laughs> sniff, sniff. Yeah, I know it's really, it's really helpful. I've wooed on my Switch game... I have wooed Shane, which I'm regretting. I don't think I want to marry him from what I've heard. Um, he's easy to woo. You give him chili peppers or beer, but he's an alcoholic, so I'm trying to not give him beer. But you find him all over the forest, just drunk. The cauldron is bubbling with ingredients. All right. And I just eat it from a strange guy in the forest. But they say that if you marry Shane, he goes back to drinking. And so you'll get like beer cans all over your house and stuff. So I'm not going to marry Shane, even though he's easy. I look like I'm about to throw up. Whoa, trippy. Yeah, and it just ruins the whole... So, like, the storyline, he is, he's drunk, so you kind of start to feel sorry for him, and then he gets his life together, and then he's like, oh, I'm going to drink sparkling water and, you know, all this stuff, and then, so then you marry him, and then when he moves in, his room is trashed with beer bottles all the time, which leads to a lot of divorces of Shane, so <laughs> I'm going to stop myself early and not do that. Now where's the axe? The axe is somewhere here, right? On the other side somewhere. Get some, try to get some cash. Which I have some. Yeah. It's helpful. Um, I think I want to woo um, I'm thinking Leah. Is, is always a good one. She's the artist, right? Or I do have a little... I have a soft spot for Sam, too. His story is kind of sad. I kind of like Sam. So I'm still deciding. Or I just get the polyamory mod and just marry them all. But I don't know if they all live in your house or not. I also feel bad for, like, Linus. Yeah, he's a cutie, right? And then he's got, like, the taking care of his family and his little brother while his dad's away. Like, it's adorable. No, I don't want my inventory full. Dad gummit. Mm, okay, what can we throw away? This thing. I don't care about you, flower. I would rather have the onions. So there we go. I could have found somebody probably to give that to, but... There we go. All right. Ooh, is there more over here? That looks intentional. I feel like I'm picking somebody's farm stuff. That's strange. Sebastian I tried to woo just because everybody talks about him. Um... I tried to woo him, but he's really hard to nail down. I could never get him. My schedule was always different. So I just kind of gave up on him. I'm going to have to go this way, don't I? 
I married Harvey my first go round. He's really boring. <laughs> He's very boring. He just uh He goes to work a couple days a week and then he kinda stares at the wall most of the time. So not too exciting. <laughs> Sebastian, you had to lose Sebastian, is that the one? Your emo, yeah. It reminded me, yeah. There's an appeal. <laughs> There's an appeal, for sure. Well, and he's kind of a cutie. I'm not gonna lie. He is sort of cute. Okay, what, if anything, are we keeping? Oh, wait, I have some of that. Oh, okay, hold on. I have a plan. We're gonna get rid of all of these, probably. Yes, there are some people that like them, but I'm gonna get rid of that. Now I need to make the scarecrow. Okay. Now... Here we go. I made the scarecrow. And I completed a task. <laughs> cool. Yay! Only a hundred dollars? Well, it's a hundred dollars I didn't have before, I guess. Okay. Now... We'll do that. And it's only the 12th, right? So I can make a lot more. Hi! I am. Hello, great sir. He just told me I was stinky. Thank you. It's not really how they greet people in the big city. All right. This stuff can definitely be incorporated into a healthy diet because it's veggies. All right. I have been told to spend all my riches on potatoes. So that's what I'm doing. Do, do, do. Oh no, I guess I have 13 mods, it says at the top. <laughs> all right. Let's make some more potatoes. All right, we got 21. And because I'm OCD, <laughs> 11, okay. Oh, did I just tear something up? I did. That was great. Okay. Gotta get closer. I'm finally getting a hang of playing on the computer, I think. I'm not close enough. All right. We got five more. One, two, three, four. Yeah, this is, I've got like 13 of them or so on here. You won't be able to really see it till I get farm animals, I think, though. That's the most mod I did. 
Next time I'll do one of the color palettes and you guys gotta tell me if you like it or not. Because sometimes the yellow kind of, I feel like it's very yellow. So they have some that just make the grass look more brown. Did I water these already today? No? Yes? Do you remember alpaca? <laughs> Yeah, mine was Ella or something is what the mod pack was called. I think it's Ella's. And it was the animals, the horse. I think the house was hers too. Um, I got like a bunch of them because they were all cute. But I want something to change the city map to. So I may have to do the expanded one maybe. It just seems like a lot of things to change. Well, then my husband has a farm on the same same account, and I don't want to mess his up too much if I do something. <laughs> it's going to mess his account up. It gives you, like, more people, right? And a whole other city or something. better watering can for sure. I wanted to get the fairy house one, but again, it would have been a surprise to my husband when he went in, went onto his farm. Oh. I think it'd be good to have new people though, though, especially like if you've played for a while, it gets kind of old dating the same five people or whatever. That's the reason I moved out of a small town is because there was nobody to hang out with because I dated everybody. Of course, they all go to the bar every Friday because there's nothing else to do and there's only five people to date, so maybe there's a connection. All right. Ooh, nice. Yeah, this one has like a turquoise kind of hair. All right, so I should keep that star potato, sell the rest. All right, okay. Yeah, I think I'll do the, that one next. I'll get the expanded universe. Do. All right, I'm going to go to bed. Yes. Nice. Mayonnaise, don't really need it yet. I have no eggs, but... All right, we need to make some tree tappers. Ooh. Medieval buildings and a pastel mod. That sounds cool. I wanted the, look here. Get your little booty out of here. Um, I wanted the one that had the little fairy stuff, like it had the mushroom trees and stuff, like big trees and flowers everywhere. Well, I think you have a grass mod, too. There's more flowers in this one than normal. I think I only need one star potato. The rest can go. All right. Okay. All right. What do I want to do? Mm -hmm. Should I try to go kill some monsters? I haven't done that. Ever. In this, in this one anyways. But you don't last very long because 
I don't have a weapon. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's more flowers. I think now. Hi. Oh. The thing that broke my heart with Linus was one day in the middle of winter, I go into the bathhouse and he's standing in the bathhouse and he goes, you know, sometimes you just get cold and you just need somewhere to go inside. And I was so sad for him. Like, can you get Linus to come live with you? Can you let Linus move in? I mean, eventually I'll have a big house. Right? And then you catch him in the trash, right? And so people were yelling at him and it's like, okay, he's fine. Give him some food. But I think he should be a roommate. There's so many people in this town that have people who aren't related to them or adopted or he could be a roommate for somebody so just go out and do it I've been craving like juice so I got this stuff it's honey, lemon, strawberry, no, water, lemon, strawberry, honey, and bee pollen. Somewhere when you marry, right? I think that I need to let him move in. You can have um, Chromebus or whatever his name is. You can have him move in with you. I, I don't know how. Um... But that's supposedly an option. All right. I am ready to get hurt and possibly pass out. Maybe not. Let's see. See, my son ruined mining for me because he cheated on the switch on one and was able to make unlimited oh do I have to go to the Easter egg festival can I do you want me to mine or do you want me to go to the Easter egg festival what do you think your call She probably brought some from home. <laughs> yeah, I've never won either. I almost won, I think I won a fishing contest once, which was hilarious because I am the worst fisher ever. I don't know how that quite worked. Okay, give me that good stuff. Oh, no, don't kill me. Wait, oh my gosh, wait, where did I put the thing? <laughs> I'm gonna die. Where's my sword? Hold on. I can't. I know. I know. I made a huge mistake. Alright, are you gonna stay over there? Be cool? Okay. Alright. I need to move this. Can I? Let's see. I'm gonna move this over next to this so I can find him easier. Okay. Now. Now bring it. I hate these things. Oh yeah, I guess you would win if you... See? This is why mining in the beginning is just really sad because I don't have the pockets. So you can't get anything good. Now I should probably have cleaned all these out first, but, you know, later, next time. Well, I guess we have time to go to the, the Easter egg thing now, huh? Because I'm out of pocket space. Do I have that yet? No. Yeah, I'm definitely going to get the fishing mod. All right. Let's...
let's at least meet everybody. Oh, oh. Wait a minute. <laughs> Why have I not thought of that? Oh my gosh. I didn't know you could do that. And I kind of feel dumb now. And you have now changed my life. So that's amazing. I don't know why I never thought of that. Dang it. <laughs> I could have done so much more in the mines. All right, well, I'm going to do that now for sure. Hey, what a strange thing. It really is. It really is. Like, yeah, no, I didn't, I don't think I realized that you could place them other places. I don't know why I didn't ever think of that, but uh, yeah, that's life changing right there. And then you can store food in there. So if you forget and you run out and like you're about to die, you can go chow down on something while it's in there. Like the things I can do now. I like her. Evelyn is adorable. He is kind of mean. He's kind of crotchety, but I get it. Welcome to the egg festival. She's stooping the mayor. Street punch is unusually good. Does that mean it's spiked? Yes. Spiked to work can make you more productive. When I first played, he was like the first guy I met, and I was like, oh, I'm going to marry Elliot. And then I decided he's far too sensitive for me, I think. Don't you also feel like in the game when you're trying to woo people? You can clearly tell that they're trying to pair up, right? So Abigail and Sebastian are a thing and they always talk about each other, right? Or whatever. And these two clearly have the hots for one another. Yeah, yeah, it's too, yeah. These two clearly have the hots for one another. So then if you try to hook up with one of them, you almost feel guilty about it because you're like breaking up the other two. Like I just feel that I'm ruining their potential. I don't know. Maybe that's me and I'm just overthinking it. But I think that's why I went with Harvey the first time. Because I'm like, Harvey's alone. He's fine. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Harvey was alone. Clint? Is Clint? Can you romance Clint? I feel like Clint's old. I don't think... He, they say it, but I think he's fairly old. But he has a crush on uh, Emily. Makes the valley feel like a real community. Yeah. And Penny always looks like a child when you see her just sitting in the grass. I always think she's one of the kids. There was a mod for Pam to make her look younger when she was in her heyday, and it was freaking hilarious. She has, like, blue eyeliner and, like, curly hair. It was really funny. All right, where is... Okay, let's get this over with. Uh, sure, I guess. I'm gonna lose anyways. Let's see. Oh, yeah. I saw, like, an anime one, too. Calm down. Okay. <laughs> well, she's probably eating the, eating the eggs, too, that if she found on the ground. She eats rocks. Emily I like, too. When she saves the bird... 
and then goes, oh, you're just like me. You're special or whatever. I, My little neurodivergent heart went out to her. All right. Can I get through there? No. Abigail is probably the one that hid the eggs, though, to be honest. There's not that many people in the town. Somebody had to do it. Oh, there's one there, but there's a basket in the way. Drats. Don't get it, Abigail. Drats. What do we got? She hid a stash. <laughs> Look at all these eggs. That was like the Gilmore Girls episode where they hid eggs in the town and then forgot where they hid them. Abigail, come on. Yeah, she's cheating. What does she get? So the other thing that I'm not there yet, I think it happens in the fall where you do the fall festival or whatever. My oldest told me that if you have the mayor's pants, you know, how he leaves his underwear or whatever at Marnie's house because he's having an affair with Marnie, that if you take his pants and you put it in your display case, like as you're in, so don't put any vegetables or anything, just put his pants in your display case. He will give you first place to shut you up about the purple shorts. So I'm gonna have to try that because I haven't tried it, but um, I've been told that that's, that's how it is. So we'll see. When my son said he didn't put any vegetables or anything else. He just did that. Reach level five in the mind. Yeah, me too. I told him at dinner, I said, oh, I finally found his pants. And he goes, or no, I said, I got second place in the, the, the fall festival. And he goes, uh, did you cheat? And I was like, no, I didn't cheat. What is the cheat? And then he goes, oh, here, this is what I do. But I had, I didn't get him till like winter, I think. Because Marnie is never around. And when she is, she's always flirting with the mayor. So I never really had a lot of time to socialize with her. I have a lone potato. Oh, out of water. Lone potato here. I'm gonna forget to water. I do have money. I guess I could go buy more potatoes. I don't know. I think my goal is to just have a bunch of cows, chickens, and honey. I think that's the, the end goal. Well, this farming business is fun. It takes all my day and I can't go talk to people. So it gets a little tedious. Or you get sprinklers. I'm also trying, I've tried um, growing really big pumpkins yet, but I, I haven't mastered that bit yet. Where they like merge together. the island map 
But I don't really like it as much as this one. So you have to like, I guess, not use sprinklers and have them really close together. You don't have like a giant patch of them. But again, I had no luck. Okay, let's go to the mines, but let me be practical about it. Let's see, I don't need the fishing pole. Don't need my watering can. I don't need the hoe and I don't need the axe. So now, I get, well, and I'm gonna, no wait, I'm gonna do your hack. There's a tree growing in my yard. What is it? Hold on. Like on my porch. Is that normal? That wasn't that big before. I don't have my hatchet. Okay. Um, E. Let's craft this bad boy. Okay, let's do two. Whatever. Okay. Now, clean out the pockets. All right. All right. Now we are in business. Do, do, do. live longer this time I don't know if it's part um, like two days ago two or three days ago it was smaller so it's getting bigger <laughs> maybe I dropped a seed and it's like a mod mistake or I don't know it might be cool oh I already forgot to put the thing up there that's okay. I'll go take it up there in a little bit. I guess we'll see. Maybe I'll lose my whole house by the end of this. Maybe I'll get a tree house. That would be a sweet mod. Get a tree house version. All right, buddy. I came prepared. And this time, you're going to die. We hope. Not before you poison me because I still suck at fighting. Die, 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 die. Come here. Nope. Nope. <laughs> it's fine. I just have no energy and no, no food. What could possibly go wrong with this? There, let's see, let's go down here. I'm not ready to go to levels that are gonna kick my butt yet. All right, oops, okay. Come on. Turn around. Okay. I want that purple rock. Ah. Oh, you're gonna come and get me, huh? Clearly can't fight and multitask. This is why I can only stream Stardew. <laughs> It was something where I actually had to kill more than one, a few things ever so often. I would, ooh, I don't think I got one that early before. I don't think I went this far last time in the, anything cool. What's over here? Mixed seeds, meh. 
Okay, um, I'm not doing too well health-wise. I could possibly die. <laughs> this is very, and let's see, these are kind of easy. The great bug steaks, which are, and I can't pick you up because I didn't drop the things off. Okay. Um, doo -doo -doo. Meh, I don't need this. Okay. I'm gonna go pick up the earth crystal. And maybe that other earth crystal. Oh. There's good things in here. And maybe those things too. Then I'm gonna go upstairs back up. Oh, okay. Alright, we're fighting. Don't don't kill me, don't kill me. Don't kill me. Die scum die. Nope. Uh, I'm I'm hurting seriously bad, okay. I'm gonna bounce after this for sure. Taking easy stuff and leaving. Go that way. Okay. I'm going upstairs. I have full pockets. Oh, there's a geode. So many decisions. Okay. No. Put my chest up at the top now. Leave the mines. All right. That that it was that easy. Oh my gosh. Mind altering, like oh my gosh. So now I could probably just put my weapon in there, right? Because I don't really need it. And my slimes probably too, because that's the only place I get them. Amazing. Amazing. All right. Do, do, do. do I have the. Oh, that's so cute. Even though they have a lot of issues, I think, too. They like fight a lot, I think. When you listen, when you listen to the story a bit. I think Robin hits him. Some domestic violence. All right. Well, I don't even have that available yet. I don't even have the aquamarine as an option. Yeah, they kind of, he kind of, but I mean, He's a moody teenager, I think, who wants to stay in his room, right? So he kind of, he chooses that too. What time is it? Seven. I can't go turn in any of these things. Oh, Haley. I have nothing to give Haley. I don't like Haley either. She's very judgmental. And I have not been able to, I mean, yeah, I can give her sunflowers, I guess, and she'll be fine. But when you give her something and you'll give her something good and she's like, oh, so disgusted. I just don't like her as a, as an individual. Um, I'll go take these some other time. I don't know what else to do with them right now. Okay. I should probably go to bed because I am not doing good. All right, so true, true. I just gave her sunflowers, but I'm definitely not going to woo her or anything. All right, it is nine o'clock, so I'm probably going to sign off, and my person needs to go to sleep because they're dying. Uh, <laughs> but thank you for hanging out with me tonight. This was cool, and. I do this every Wednesday at 8 o'clock Pacific if you want to see if my tree gets bigger. 
Uh, we'll find out next time. <laughs> but um, I'm going to sign off. I hope you have a good night. And I want to... Okay. And I will check out that mod you told me about, too. I have been... Yeah, I've been on TikTok a lot. So I'm a Nerds Gone Tiny at TikTok. So I do more TikToks. Um, I think just... I don't know. I just think quarantine, like we're here where we don't, we're in the part of the country we're at is still pretty locked down. I just haven't been, I don't have a lot of content, I think, on YouTube because we've been home for literally a year. Um, so we just aren't doing anything cool to make YouTube videos, I feel. Um, but I'm on Insta or TikTok a lot. So come say hi to me over there. Cool. And uh, so I'll see you soon. Bye. Good night. I'm going to stop my recording.